Sport holds a precious, almost vague, place in my heart. Do I know much about it? Maybe not. But that doesn't stop me from holding it very dear. Yes, bats, rackets, and all those balls. There really is something for everyone when it comes to the proud tradition of sports in Two Point County. We're sorry for the litter that you... Oh, sorry, that's mine. is non-refundable. Harrison Wolf on Two Point Radio. Congratulations, you found me. It's the Wolfman, Harrison Wolf, bringing you the truth from an undisclosed location here on Two Point Radio. Let's start thinking some radical thoughts while you listen to a piece of pre-digested popular music. All right? All right. Staff are reminded to be inspirational.
Asked questions. No, I will not be your friend. Let's talk about the news. The news is like tea leaves or constellations, or when you find a singular glove on a fence post in the park. You can't look at it straight on. You gotta read between the lines. So when I say people in Hogsport can expect some minor flooding over the next week, what am I really saying? Think about it. Distracted students should pretend that they're listening. questions will make you look stupid.
I see Jumbo McNally is sticking with the hard sell on the humbly named Jumbo University. If I was looking for an education, it sure wouldn't be from that guy that sells the nuts. That information, unlike Jumbo University, was totally free. You're welcome, listeners. Maintenance announcement. Plants need water, remember? Students are reminded to have the time of their lives. Guys, guys, hear me out. What if we went back to school? It started as a class reunion and ended with them back in class. That's crazy! Hey, I'm climbing on a statue! Everybody get in the shed! I can't revise anymore. My knees hurt. <laughs> Roderick Cushion is Varsity Freshman in Immature Students. Students are reminded that you came here on purpose. Thank <laughs> you. 
Students are asked not to ask questions. We're back, but I was never really gone. What do you think I do while you're all listening to music? You probably think I eat a biscuit or go for a little walk, and sure, sometimes I do do that, but in a different sense. Nothing could be further from the truth. Here's some more music while I do something totally unexpected. Unattended sandwiches will be eaten by me. questions. No, I've not seen your frog.
I've been playing some new video games recently, and man, has it been a while. The last time I played video games, you were a tiny hexagon, and you had to chase a squirrel to the top of the castle, or something like that. Anyway, I tried that new Meat Wizard game everyone's going on about, and boy, what a ride. Who knew that being a spell-casting, salami-wielding sorcerer would be so much fun? When you say it out loud, it sounds obvious. The administrator is reminded to stay hydrated. asked questions. Your food is cold because the oven wasn't on. Why is robotics such a popular career path for kids these days? I tell you, I'm seriously concerned that we're losing our perfectly understandable fear of the machines. I mean, don't you see what's happening? When you build a robot, you're working for the robots. We gotta make a stand. Join me in flushing my doorbell down the toilet. United we stand, together we flush. <laughs> Students are reminded to find themselves.
was talking on campus. Thank you. We're just finishing up for today. I hope it was everything you dreamed it would be. Think about it next time you're sleeping and all the false realities drop away around you, leaving you playing chess with a sassy hat stand, finally feeling the real unfiltered truth. See you around. Visitors should be checked in and then removed immediately.
simply asked questions. No, you can't have an extension. Hitting the box doesn't mean what you think it means. There's a fly in here. You're listening to Campus Radio. I'm Maggie Watmore, and I just learned what this button does. I'm not sure when I would use it, but I suppose it's good to know. One more time. Excellent. Students are reminded that some grades are personal. If you don't know where your class is, is it really worth going? Thank you. 
I can't read what this next segment is about because I've lost my glasses. But I am told that that's quite ironic. So, yeah, here's you. Yes, it's not quite business as usual here at Duckworth Campus Food Court, where one of the servers has lost a contact lens. Unfortunately, they do believe the lens was lost during the preparation of a particularly big lasagna. They're asking every student to check their portion before they chew. But as of yet, no sight of the missing lens. Plagiarism is not a belief system. Here's Wanda, who'll be telling us the coolest way to get around the county. Yes, the bus is the new hot way to travel. Have you been on the bus? Oh, it's amazing. They're like huge cars. I am obsessed. And you don't have to drive. You can look at the scenery, check your phone, you know, all the fun stuff you usually do while driving. But this way, it's much more safe. We are approaching the end of the academic year. Try not to worry.
summer is a good time to relax and prepare for next year. must vacate the campus. End of year results are now available. No unauthorized panicking. Students are reminded that this is the fun part. What am I going to do with my life? I just don't know. Orb. Huh? What? Come to an Orb Foundation Learning Center and replace your mind with the power of the Orb. Oh, amazing. I'll do that then. Thanks. We're sorry for the litter that you... Oh, sorry, that's mine. students should make a good first impression. No pressure. Welcome to the start of a new year. I'll be your host. Hello.
Tuition fees may be spent on administrative bonuses. That's all from us today at Campus Radio. As expected, there wasn't really a good opportunity to use that button during the show. So before we leave, I thought we'd have one more go. There you have it. University gives you a bright future and clouds in the dead. Students are reminded that I'm not your mum. It's not on your CV. It didn't happen. Not to me. is a test announcement, not a real announcement.
administrator is reminded to stay hydrated. Students are reminded to be in two places at once. The Harrison Wolf Show, baby. All right. Oh. Hey, this is Harrison Wolf, and thanks for stopping by. Today, we're going to be talking about a subject that's near and dear to my heart. The one thing you need when things are getting hairy. You hear something funny outside, or you're just hiding from the milkman. That's right. Today, we're talking panic rooms. Questions? No. 
Every good panic room starts with its supplies. Now some things are a must. Your crackers, your flashlight, your bottles of water, sure. But don't be afraid to show some personality. I, for one, keep a bowling ball in my panic room. I find it's the perfect place to practice. Now, when it comes to surveillance, I'm strictly an anti-camera kind of guy. My philosophy is, I can't see you, you can't see me. So, I like to keep things as low-tech as possible. I'd recommend strategically placed strings attached to some bells. You hear a ring, and you got yourself a visitor. Of course, sometimes it's the doorbell, and you really do have a visitor. If you want to get real crafty, just leave a load of rakes in your yard. No one suspects a rake in the yard, but you'll hear the sucker when he steps on one and takes a handle to the chops. Ouch. Visitors should be checked in and then removed immediately. Intruders on campus, oh no.
Unattended sandwiches will be eaten by me. New from Smell My Cash. Being a student is hard enough. <laughs> the least we could do is give you loads of money. Smell My Cash for students. Sure, you have to pay it back, but that's future use problem. Security breach. Please change your passwords. Sorry.
here's a question from Gyro in Duckworth. What are some of your favorite panic room pastimes? And thanks for the question, Gyro. I find that you can have a lot of fun with a little bouncy ball. In fact, one time I was bouncing, lost track of time, and it turned out that I'd been doing it for 16 hours. I went cold turkey after that, meaning I was hungry and took a turkey sandwich out of the freezer. Mmm. Turkey. If it's not on your CV, it didn't happen. Not to me. Transferable. 